Hey guys, it's now Tuesday. I had class this morning, so Robbie went to the Victoria and Albert Museum, and then I went to class, and now it's like 12, and I'm going to meet up with him right now. And we're gonna go to Harrods, and then I think maybe Borough Market, and then the London Eye. And then, where else? Oh, and then tonight I have a required um, play with my class, unfortunately, because I'm excited for the play, but obviously like, I can't go with Robbie. But it's called Dear England, so that should be interesting. But anyway, I just came back to his Airbnb just to like take a second and try to get some work done and just like refresh myself and change into a purse. But I'm just wearing this cute little maxi dress from Zara. And I'm gonna be literally out, I think, until like nine or 10 tonight, so long day, but that's okay. Let's go. Spirit of my silence, I can hear you, but I'm afraid to be near you. We've been waiting in line for literally two hours, an hour, an hour. <laughs> or more. Like an hour and ten minutes. <laughs> and I'm like debating how worth this better be worth it. <laughs> It'll, oh, that's my kitchen. It'll be worth it. Where to begin? And I don't know where to begin. Somewhere in the desert, there's a forest. Guys, we just got off the one and I, and let me just say, uh, overrated, underrated, overrated. overrated. <laughs> the issue was is that we had these like teen boys in front of us and who smelled like bo so bad, and we were avoiding the entire time in line, like Hi, not in front of us in line, like significantly in front of us in line. Right but then we literally go up in line to like, and they put you in these like files. Okay, we're like perfect. the third, and we're like the only two in the front. We're like, oh, we're gonna go by ourselves, and they load the two in front of us, which are those teen boys, onto the thingy. And so like there's no way they go with us. And he was like, you two, you two on. I literally stopped in my tracks and no. You cannot be talking about us. Like you can't be. You can't like be. it was like some it was like a prank. Where's the camera? Ha ha. It was just really hot and everyone there was cranky. And the lady the lady chaperone that was with those nasty team boys was and so was literally everyone on that. This little girl, the girl influencer, she was annoying. Oh, we're done. <laughs> I'm giving but I don't know where to begin But I don't know where to begin Again I lost my strength completely Oh be near me, tired old mare With the wind in your hair Amethyst and flowers on the table It's Robbie's so last full day in London, and we just ate at Egg Break. Oh, in Notting Hill, and now we're gonna head to Daunt Books. And why are we doing that? It is Leave it favorite It's our friend Leave's favorite bookstore. We're gonna get her a little souvenir. And I went here when I studied abroad. If you studied abroad with me, you're probably recognizing it. And I got the same thing, the truffle scrambled eggs, and it was so good. And now we're walking. Hey guys, so it's now Robbie's last evening in London. And I had class for four hours today. I am in school here, so I still have school. <laughs> and even though sometimes it does feel like a bit of a vacation or a holiday, as some may say. <laughs> and we're going to the Ivy Kensington Brasserie tonight. It's really close to his Airbnb, so it's just convenient. And he had a long day at the British Museum in Kensington Palace. And, and then I had class, so it just makes sense. Just quickly changed. Don't love my outfit. I wish I did, because then Robbie could take cute pics of me. But I'm just wearing my classic throw blazer on, make it an outfit. Um, literally nothing special, but. And also, we've been literally binge watching Never Have I Ever season two don't binge all week. Don't binge what? Don't binge watch, it at night. watch it at night. We don't binge watch it. We're in London, so we're not binge watching. A friend is a friend, and we all know. This will end. 
Chimney Swift that finds me Be my keeper Silhouette of the sea Hey guys, so I lost my glasses So we went back to the restaurant uh, slash pub We slash just went to the pub across from our Airbnb right And it was Robbie fun. got a beer and he hated it yeah. So then I continued drinking my Aperol spritz And I, I feel tipsy And he's not And uh, <laughs> an hour, I've had a long day Four hours People of class stumble. And I can't And he's making me go back to the restaurant Because I realized we got home I can't find my glasses And I'm literally blind on the contacts so. Cheers to Off to bed such a cozy setup, and I'm so excited to go to bed. This the industrial fan on me, and a kind of packing fan. Tomorrow we're gonna go to breakfast, and then part ways, and then he's gonna go to the airport. Now I'm gonna go back to my flat, and then I have class, and I have a field trip, and I have so much going on, and so much work to catch up on. But it's been so fun, and other than the fact that Robbie lost class tonight which was not it but hopefully manifesting that in the morning I vlog and we say we found them <laughs> we just left breakfast oh my god we just left breakfast and now we're walking back to the Airbnb okay guys so for reference this next clip is two days later Robbie left it was so sad and I had so much schoolwork to do but then my friends and I the next day had a day trip to Stonehenge and Windsor Castle and Bath. So that's what you're going to see at the end of this vlog right now. And yeah, thank you guys for watching and let's get into the day trip. It was kind of iconic. How are we feeling? I'm excited. With all of on the five seater in the back of the bus. And it's, what time is it? Can we get a time? 8.07. Wait, did you say? 8.12. I walk down, then you will see the long walk. And through the courtyard to the left. The king is home. The king is apparently home today, so that's kind of cool. We have an yeah, hour where our yeah. bus will leave us. She will leave us, she said. <laughs> so we gotta go. We gotta hurry. She was berating us for like 22 minutes. It's like, the people who were late, but like, they were only. And they left, guys. Our tour group left behind people. They, they made it on right at the end. Oh, and then and that's why in front of them she was like... <laughs> Yeah. Wait, did you hear them? Like, did you hear them? Uh, oh god, guys, it's literally like Lizzie McGuire movie bus group tour slash Monte Carlo when they get lost be left behind on their bus. Yeah. Are they? They're leaving! My name's Riley. What's yours? Meg! The bus is leaving! Um, you sing for the dead. What is that song? You sing for the dead. I see the signal searchlight strike me in the window, and 
Hello. There was almost like a tribal medicinal like ceremony going on. So I don't know, comment down below if Stonehenge is supposed to have like healing or like not like religious, but, like spiritual powers. Cause that was really crazy, but it's really cool to see. And now we have to head back because our tour guide has made it very clear she will leave without us and she will not care. But that was really, really cool to see. Something you always like imagine seeing at some point in your life. And it's cool to see it. Like a ceremony of singing or something going on. I don't really know. But now we're gonna head back to the shuttle and then we're going to baths, our last stop of the day. We're doing like the Roman baths, museum, whatnot, and then headed back to London tonight. It's been like a long day, but it's worth it to do stuff like this. My room. I got nothing to prove Well I got nothing to prove the Bridgerton Modiste um, shop. It's so cool. We just got postcards. <laughs> Allie and I are really excited and we just lost our tour group on purpose. So <laughs> there's that. I forgive you, mother. I can hear you. And I love to be near you. But every road leads to an end. Yes, every road. Like the Roman boss. <laughs> <laughs> we have two very sleepy people <laughs> in the wild. Be <laughs> well. video might end here, but I tried, okay? Signing off the mask.